DFX version 2.0 is now fully MIDI compatible and works with any MIDI controller or keyboard. Plug your controller and drive any button or fader from DFX. In my case, I'm using a Novation Launch Control XL, a Lightning to USB adapter, and of course my iPad with DFX 2.0. First, connect your MIDI controller to your iPad using the USB adapter. Launch DFX. Go to Settings. Switch on MIDI and then tap Select. I choose Launch Control XL as an input. OK, I'm now connected. Tap Learn and start assigning your MIDI controller to DFX. First, let's connect the volume of each trackpad to a fader and the main volume to this fader. Then, let's assign the X and Y of this trackpad to these knobs. And let's assign the previous or next effect of each trackpad. That's it. That was how to turn DFX into a professional multi-effects station.